Quick, funniest reason for someone to become a villain. That's a crush on the hero and can't be normal about it. Perfect. Her eyes were the sickly green of the sky before a tornado. And to his horror, he discovered she could throw cows around just as easily. Or Orc wife? If you like the word queer, reblog. Fun umbrella. We're all sitting under it like the big rainbow thing in elementary school gym class. Behold, the queer community. Look how happy they are. Oh, to be a generic enemy, but with a very interesting design that leaves a lasting impression and slowly gains a weird cult following. All right, YouTube comments, which character are they talking about? Baby girl, your design is so complicated and hard to draw. Please stop. I had a dream. I got an ass that said, can you do that thing where you only make mask posts for a day? And I was like, what does this mean? And Anna said, you only make posts that come off as masculine all day for a full day. And I was like, you know what? Sure. And I queued a low-res picture of a flaming skull to be posted every hour on the hour for 24 hours and then didn't check Tumblr until it was over. If someone hasn't done that yet, do it. You know, as a treat for the defunct land guy, we should all just try to convince Elon Musk that he would be so, 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 so good at designing roller coasters. Please, oh please, I want to see this. Emails can lift ten times their body weight, prefer dubstep music over classical, and they can grieve their dead, which makes them a terrifying and hopeless animals. And that's why we don't want to send them, all right? Hello there. <gasps> B -b Correct. And I sparkle. You are a special little bean. Protect this one. You're all the coolest people I vaguely know. Trying to talk in Discord servers feels like trying to sit at the lunch table with the popular kids in middle school and totally fucking it up. Don't mind me, I'll just be lurking in the corner over there. <laughs> Pokemon, friend, what do you think of highly advanced AI such as ChatGBT or Bard? Oh, the parasocial relationships lonely people are going to have for those robots. Joke's on you. I already have one with you. Okay, this, this is going to sound weird, but I, I need your credit card number. Buddy? I just learned that there is going to be a live-action Barbie movie, and I expect two things from it. One, for it to be as good as Legally Blonde at minimum. And two, a scene where Bobby hands in a resume and it's as thick as a novel. Bonus, number three, Barbie saying, don't worry, I'm a professional for literally anything. Legit the scariest dream I've ever seen. Salmon when they narrowly escape a bear. Yeah. Sometimes touching grass isn't enough. Sometimes all you really need is to fight God. And that's perfectly okay. It's literally every Final Fantasy ever, isn't it? And now, a bad joke by Jeff. <clears throat> A doctor and a lawyer were talking at a party. However, their conversation was constantly interrupted by people who were describing their ailments and asking the doctor for free medical advice. After an hour of this, the exasperated doctor asked the lawyer, what do you do to stop people from asking you for legal advice when you're out of the office? I give it to them, replied the lawyer, and then I send them a bill. The doctor was shocked, but agreed to give it a try. The next day, still feeling slightly guilty, the doctor prepared the bills. When he went to place them in his mailbox, he found a bill from the lawyer. <laughs> I mean, come on, you should have seen it coming. 